Well, hey guys, how's everybody doing? I hope you're all well. Hope everybody's had a great weekend. Uh, <laughs> I needed this about like I needed another hole in my head. Um, well, I've got one. But we were at Rural King, and they had some 500 aisles, and I was like, I swear to next saw I need to buy is a little 170 to modify. Um, <laughs> it is what it is. I just want to do it. Um, and we were looking, and they have a little section there where they have things that are damaged. The last time we were there, I got a bar and chain for like 20 bucks. Um, but they have a section of things that have been returned and damaged there in the steel section. Um, and wife's seen this little 170. I don't know if you can see or not. Probably here in the back. She has a broke handle. Um, if I want to change the handle, it's like... I can pick an OEM one up for, I don't know, it was 30, 40 bucks used, or a Chinese one for 25, but honestly, I think I can take, I can repair that to where it'll be good enough and not have to worry about it, but other than that, it's a brand new saw, sold as is, um, got it quite some bit cheaper than a new one would cost, they honestly actually had a 171 there too, that nothing was wrong with it was just a return for just a little more money. I started to buy it, but um, I've been wanting to modify 170 for a while, and it was one of them deals I just wanted to start the new saw instead of something that was worn out. But needless to say, I got a pretty good deal on it, but um, I'm assuming it runs, it's new, all but the handle being broken, and I'm guessing, you know, maybe it was dropped in the store during shipment or something. Um, carburetor just has the single adjustment from what I can see for the low jet. 90% um, of these have that. I think very few of maybe the older ones like the 017s might have had an adjustable carb. I could be wrong on that too but um, I know there's something out there that we can easily swap onto it when we modify the saw but what this is about is just kind of we're going to fill it up, null it up. I'll do that off camera here and we'll see if this thing will fire up and then I've got a little piece of what was that hickory I struck down in there or was it the oak it's, um, I think it was a little piece of hickory um, it's hard as flint it ain't you know that big around but for a 35 cc saw it'll let us know what we've got I've had a few of these here I've honestly got one here right now that I've got to do a repair on this week or sometime but um off topic but anyway i'll pause you guys we'll fuel this up and see what happens all right guys i didn't point out this one does have a 16 inch bar it's 3 8 low pro um anti-vibe low kickback safety chain kind of deal um that's fine we'll get us a better chain for it when we modify the saw and again that was the only reason for buying this was to modify it and see how hot we can make it um, without going too crazy like a removable head or anything but um, anyway um, it's had some residual fuel in the tank but you'll get that from when they fire them up at the manufacturer when they do their quality control but um, anyway let's see if it even runs I have no idea if it even runs it was sold as is no warranty at all damaged unit got plenty of compression there we go nine pulls about right on a fresh I think she's running good enough to go out back and like I said I don't have a big piece of wood in the stand but come on guys it's 35 cc's not many people are buying this to uh, cut big wood with but uh, anyway I'll bring you back when we're out back at the saw stand.
All right, guys, let's see how our sold as is saw cuts. And we'll have to be careful. We got we got a few slices we can make before we get back into the log stand. And this is very hard wood. It is hard as a rock. <laughs> a better look at it um, like I said I've had these here before it runs good I don't think I've ever had a brand new one here um, I just ran a little 42 cc craftsman that we picked up for the wife at Lowe's that we video of it before this um, could be the chain I don't know but um, I may make another video timing them against one another but I believe this one 70 is a little faster than that stock craftsman and it's I think it's got seven cc's on this and um, anybody knows these are awesome little saws they will last forever I don't know if I've ever seen many people at all down them I've got one in there right now I said earlier belongs to a family member to do a repair on it's just like the clutch something simple but saws every bit of 20 years old and it looks it to you and it it still runs great um but anyway, guys, um, I'd say this one will be a good base for modification. Uh, brand new saws always are. But anyway, um, if you buy one of these, that's basically what you're going to get and how it's going to perform. Um, as always, thank y'all for watching, liking, commenting, subscribing. Um, y'all have y'all have a great day.